today we're going to do coconut oil. I have this one and I have this one. Okay, so they're of course from different places. This one's from Kroger's, this one's from the Dollar Tree. Um, this one does say 100% Pure refined, which I don't Please believe. Please do is not pure. pay attention to my nails. I think pure refined means it's just been processed. Um, you can tell by the way it looks. I don't know if you can see that. Like it's really clumpy. Versus this one. Uh oh. And see, it's dripping out. Actually, got some more in it. Um, versus this one. That's not that clumpy. This one is actually cold pressed, unrefined. So this means it hasn't been processed. Um, but the thing about coconut oil is you can kind of use whichever one your pockets are willing, you know, allowing you to use. Um, they both have the same effects, like literally. I kind of want to demonstrate, but I haven't opened this one yet. So um, I'll demonstrate later on to show you the difference um, between something that I do. Uh, like makeup remover or something so another one I need that. or something else um so i want to talk to you today about the uses of coconut oil i'm not gonna talk about you know ingesting it but you can ingest coconut oil but i'm not talking about that today i'm going to be talking about the topical uses and the stuff you can do for your hair your skin and stuff like that so, um, first thing is like lotion, which I just kind of used it. You can see it on my hands, kind of, sort of. I used it as lotion. Um, it's a really good moisturizer, so for your hair also. Um, mouthwash. Uh, a lot of people don't know this about coconut oil, but it extracts the bad bacteria out of your mouth. I use it on my own teeth. Um, a lot of people do not know that, but try it and see how it works. And you gotta whip, uh, wash it around your mouth for a minute, and I'll do a video on that to show you like how much you need and when you don't when you're cleaning them out. Um, also, makeup remover, which I've already done a video on that one. Um, yeah, it's real good. Hair and skin moisturizer, I already said that. Lotion, and I use it for like kind of a deep conditioner for my hair, so my hair will be so shiny and looking so good. I actually used it this morning when I did my like twist out put it on my hair um use on acne I don't know about this one but this is something that I saw so I don't know I try it for y'all we'll do it when I get a big old pimple these aren't really pimples these don't ever go away I don't know about that when I get a pimple like something I'll do it um cold sores you know because cold sore is like where your mouth is dry and stuff so that makes sense lip balm you got some dry lips ladies put that on your lips this winter please 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 do not go around with dry lips we do not want that we don't want these men talking about girl you got some crusty lips no. not myself y'all catch me let me know because i try not to and i got big lips so i can't get too much dry stuff um scrub gotta add something to that uh bath oil like if you're in the bathtub and you want something to moisturize your skin while you're in the bath just add a little maybe like a couple of teaspoons or tablespoons to it you know to fill up the bathtub um oh also i meant to mention this last time when i was talking about like what my page is gonna be about so it's not only gonna be about hair stuff it's also or uh, remedies it's also gonna be about hair stuff so I'm gonna teach y'all like how I do my hair and like what I do my hair and stuff like that um also I want to do stuff about animals because I'm really big on animals I love animals so I kind of want to throw that in there too this is like a cutoff so yup um also oh yeah add animals and hair stuff also with the coconut oil going back to that it also fades aging and sunspots so, a glowing, glowing lotion, you know, if you put this on your skin, like, look at my skin, like, 
I used I mean I don't want to pull my hair like that but <laughs> uh my wrinkles in my forehead used to be really bad but so this is how my skin looks I used to wake up like right in the shower because it's like to kill my skin there's no fine lines or at least it's not supposed to be um toothpaste the same thing as mouthwash stretch marks same thing as fade, fade age and sunspots because, I mean, technically, you know, the older you get, the more, you know, your skin stretches and stuff like that. And it doesn't have elasticity. So, you know, coconut oil kind of helps with the elasticity. Um, cracked heels. We don't want to go around with dry skin at all. Like, this winter, we're going to make sure we're going to be well-groomed. Our heels going to be looking nice. Our skin going to be looking nice. Our hair going to be on fleek. You know, I'm like walking around looking dusty. Um, breath freshener, same thing as mouthwash. It it takes the bacteria out of you, out of your mouth. So if you eat something, oh, if you eat if you eat something, um, I need it for the right now. See what makes it work. Um, if you eat something and your mouth is stinky. Just go ahead and throw you some coconut oil in there and mouth wash around and it'll help you. Um and, oh, it's an antioxidant. It has an SPF of four to five, so that means it blocks the sun. Um it blocks the sun. Um so it's not technically really strong enough to block the sun, but it's strong enough for a base so basically you're coating your skin so that way it's prepared for the sun but you need SPF of I believe uh, don't quote me on this like about 30 I think or 8 or something like that I don't know um, <laughs> we'll find that out later um, baby bath cause it's really good with skin you know you want your baby to be soft you know, just put, don't put don't make a bad bath Full of coconut oil, please do not make a bag full of coconut oil. Just put coconut oil in the baby's bag. Um, flaky scalp treatment. Um, you know, we got dry hair, which my hair is not dry at all. Like, I use oils, not just coconut oil, but other oils. So, yeah, flaky scalp. Um, a lot of people don't know about this one. But cheekbone highlighter, cause like it's a it's a oh I'm about to show you actually I have highlighter on my skin already as y'all can see my skin kind of oily already but look at this it's not white look at this it's no highlighter I mean of course you want to rub it in a little bit cause you don't want it to be super duper 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 shiny look at look, look at that look at that. Okay, and this is, I'm going to close it out with telling y'all kind of what I think, like I've seen this on another a guy's video, and I'll tell y'all what his name is below in the link, but um, his, it was um, basically what coconut come from, the word, it's a Sanskrit of Kappa Vinkla, Vinkla, something like that, which means necessary tree of life, you know, coconut oil can be food, it can be water, your skin get just different stuff so use more coconut